YouTubers, it's Ken from KPD Productions TV. Welcome back to another Thirsty Thursdays just for you. To my right, we have Aaron from Aaron's Food Adventures. How are you, sir? Doing well, Ken. How are you? I'm doing good. Welcome to the show. Thank you for having me. <laughs> no problem. And what's this thing mean when you uh, do that all the time? Basically, it's what we call a shotgun Hawaii. Hang loose, man. Hang loose. Yeah. Okay, Aaron, what are we going to be trying today, sir? It is not your father's root beer, but not just any not your father's root beer. It's alcoholic, and it's 10.7% ABV. So it's uh, on a rating scale of root beers. Does it does it taste like any specific root beer that you are familiar with? Because I'm I'm partial to A and W root beer from the from the tap. Does you know, it taste like that at all, or? It's been a while since I've had just regular root beer. You know, just the you know the big brands and whatnot. Right. Uh, I've. May, you know, it's been like Barks or something like that, from what I remember, okay. or even Mug. Well, crack point, I have absolutely no idea myself. <laughs> okay, well, let's, I, I don't have a really let's try this. <laughs> all right, let's That's see if I can right. actually get stuff open because I'm really horrible at getting stuff open. And look at oh, that. Oh, really? I, and you I, nailed it. I know. There, okay. The, there's uh, the world is ending. I'll do. I'll do the honors. I'll pour yours first and be sure. polite. So it is basically a root. Uh, elk. It's not a beer though. I, I, I'm, I'm almost thinking it's like a beer. Well, they call it a spiced ale, which is a type of, you know, beer, basically. But So it is a beer. But, you know, otherwise people say hard sodas or hard root beers. Oh, and whatnot. right. So, but as you can smell, it probably you can smell it. It does smell like root beer. It looks like a root beer or a dark lager or something. Mm -hmm. And it smells like root beer with alcohol in it. Mm -hmm. It's definitely maltier, and it's you can get more of the octane in there. It does have the uh, uh, bark. Like rum. <laughs> it, it does have the bark smell. Mm -hmm. Almost smells like there's rum in there too. <laughs> well, cheers, sir. All right, cheers. Wow. Yeah, yeah. That's ten percent alcohol, right? <laughs> wow. I'm digging that just because it's it's so much like root beer, but it is definitely the adult version of root beer. Lots of nostalgia in there for me because I'm just getting a whole bunch of root beer, but even more octane than the 5.9 percent counterpart it's it is like somebody had a regular root beer and then like i guess dumped vodka in it because mm -hmm. i guess it has a vodka yeah, yeah. Uh, out of all the alcohols that you mm -hmm. could place that with right. i would say it'd be vodka mm -hmm. uh yeah vodka yeah. and root beer that's the flavor i'm definitely getting that that punch that a vodka would would give me i think you're spot on i think i'd like to try the five percent yeah, the five percent. I think this is a little bit too mm -hmm. too much alcohol f flavor in my mouth, and it's killing the root beer for mm -hmm. me. And that's why actually the five point nine percent really took off because it really just tastes like root beer, and it's super dangerous. Yeah. And if you've had it out there, you know, let Ken know that you've had it <laughs> and what you think. All right, guys, uh, you can rate it first. Be my guest. Well, it's a, it's still a five out of five for me. It would wow. be a go out and get it now on Ken's scale. This is absolutely phenomenal. If there was an even higher rating for the 5.9%, I would give that higher rating to the 5.9%. Yeah, I have on, on that on my rating scale, that would be I go out and get an L plus. Yeah, right? there you it's, go. It's like super, super amazing. Yes. Uh, but on my rating scale, guys, I would give it a recommend because I think it's just too much. It's too strong for alcohol for me. Mm -hmm. uh, I, the root beer part of it is amazing. Uh, the alcohol part of it is still a bit too strong. I'd love to try the five percent next time I'm in town, and, and you can because you can buy this here, right? You can buy this here. Not sure what the availability is like in Canada or whatnot, but um, yeah, you can certainly get this here. All right, guys, I'd like to thank Aaron for being on the show. Absolutely. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you for having me. Uh, if you want to check out Aaron's uh, channel, uh, check it out as Aaron's Food Adventures. The, the link is in the description or on his shirt. Uh, if you like my videos, guys, please subscribe. It is absolutely free. If you like this video, though, give it a thumbs up. Ding, 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 ding. And we'll see you next time on another Ken and Aaron Thirsty Thursdays. Ken and Aaron out. Boop. Thirsty Thursdays. Welcome back to another Ken Domic. We are recording, right? Okay, good. We're here at VidCon and uh, we're just doing a bunch of. So, what have you brought to. Percent uh, version. Uh, we are here at VidCon. Uh, I said VidCon. He's like, what the hell are you talking about? That's hanging loose, right?